everyone. Hello. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. And feel a lot like Christmas for Florida. For Florida. It's so chilly. Yeah. <laughs> it's not that bad, but yeah, it's about 60 degrees right now. Yeah, right? it's like 59 in the car. Okay, so yeah. something like that. I was close. It's chilly. Mm -hmm. I'm wearing a coat because yep. it's well, chilly. I can't hold mine up, but what magic bands are we using? Oh, and we have Christmas... Star Wars fans that are new this year. Gingerbread. Really, yeah, they're gingerbread, mm -hmm. which is super cute. So we're in the spirit. I have my yep. Christmas Yoda shirt on. Yep, and we are, but why are we here? Why are we here, Brandon? We are heading to finally, thank you, Sci Fi Dining. At the last minute, it popped up. Brandon is so happy. We, Sarah's happy too, everyone. I am um, happy to go. But uh, yeah, Sci Fi Dining, it's been what, two years? Two years, and that is Over so two long. Years. Yeah, and we might not go for another two years because it's dang near impossible to get in here. Because walk-ups, you're not happening. Um, I would like to say now, I forgot about this till I was talking right now. Uh -huh. When we go in, we are going to ask for a saucer section because we prefer that. And also for you, it's a lot easier. Yeah, More light and everything. But if not, our vlog may... Do you want to explain what those saucers are so people know what if you ever bend inside? Oh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> She's better at it than I am, everyone. So the flying saucers are like old 1950s style, like um, outdoor like picnic tables that are in the back of the restaurant. They're more well lit, and then they usually use those for walk-up requests for dining as opposed to the cars because Sci-Fi Dining is a themed restaurant, yep. so you sit in little 1950s cars like you're at an old driving theater. Yeah, and uh, which is fine. It's awesome, but you sit side by side looking forward at a movie screen projecting old vintage commercials and sh movies and everything like that. Um, so it's a little, and it's dark. Not ideal for it's vlogging. It's not idea f ideal for vlogging or anything like that at all. Uh, but we try to get the saucer section, so we are going to try again today. If not, we will work with what we got there. Yeah, I can't wait. I'm super excited. Mm -hmm. You ready to head in? Yeah, I'm hungry and I'm excited for Christmas stuff. Sci-fi dining, we're coming for you. Christmas, we're coming for you. Let's go. All right, so we are, well, we're here with trash going by right there, but we're here outside Gertie, which is an ice cream place. And, and it's actually open. And it's actually open, which has been rare. Um, and Gertie, as you can see, has a little uh, Santa Claus hat on and a little, uh, it's a, it's a and it's a 50th ornament. anniversary it's ornament. Cute. And we got some footage of that. But um, Gertie's important to Hollywood Studios because of its history. It was one of the first animations in 1914. Yeah, with the dinosaur. With a dinosaur. And it, I believe, interacted with the person on stage kind of thing, yeah. the performer. But yeah, anyway, so historic. And there are, foot, around this entire lagoon area here, there are footprints from Gertie, which maybe we can get some footage of that. Oh, yeah, that would be cool. Insert that to show that Gertie walked over here. I know, but, so. it's, but it's open on the coldest day. Coldest day, yeah. In like eight months. Yeah, we have not seen this opened in a long, long, long time. But uh, it is open now, so yeah. should we get ice cream? Not here. We are at Sci-Fi Dining. No, because I don't do dairy ice cream. True. Yeah. I do. But, however, the non-dairy ice cream I've had with Sarah is actually quite good. I know. We're going to have some fun. I'm going to have some, have some night. You'll see that in a little bit. So, 
we sat down in the saucer section. It, they said it would be like a 30 to 40 minute wait for the saucer section. It was 45 seconds. Insane. But um, you can see how amazing this restaurant is. I, again, it's no matter how good our iPhones are, it's still not the best for the low light video or anything, but it's incredible in here. Our eyes, I think, are adjusted now a little more. Um, and hopefully we don't get copyright struck with this music. Yeah. Um, our server, Mike, has been outstanding. Um, he came up after allergies and everything, and we already ordered. We ordered before he even took our time. We know what we want, but we'll talk about that when we get it. But yeah, look, I mean, there can be... Uh, so yeah, it's incredible. Now, let me ask you this, everyone. We have brought up movies enough in our videos here and there. Would anyone leave a comment? Sarah, don't cut this. Would you like to see us at home? Maybe Sarah can make a gluten-free or an allergy-friendly meal, and it's like Sarah and Brandon talk about movies. Um, would you like to see a separate side? It's like dinner and a movie that used yeah, to be on like TBS movie. or whatever. Yeah, but we could maybe bring up. This is on the spot, oh, Sarah. No. I don't know what I was going to say, but I promise. But um, because when it comes to movies, we have a lot to say. I go on. Anyway, so, I think everybody on this channel yeah, knows that. Knows. <laughs> but um. <laughs> anyway, so amazing. We're here. We're back. Um, hopefully, we'll, we'll be back more often. This, this Two is, years, it feels so good. Yeah, this is the best <laughs> restaurant that it's Hollywood City. Again, if you disagree with that, that's cool. I respect that. But seriously, this is good. Um, I mean, just the theming is great. I mean, we're at an old 50s? Yeah. 50s? Yeah. So, speaking about 50s. Oh, no. Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, Indiana Jones, is better than the last crusade, so it's a little And that's it. So we're getting our food. We actually have a salad to split, it, and our server made sure they actually gave us tools. They split yes. it in half for us so we didn't have to cut it ourselves, which is super nice. So we got um, the regular wedge salad, which has blue cheese, a blue cheese dressing, bacon, um, some chives, some balsamic vinaigrette. They also have a gluten-free and vegan version too, so just know that there is options if you are dairy-free. Um, we just ended up with the regular one. I'm gonna take a bite. All it's right, taking a bite. Mm -hmm. How is it? It's good. <laughs> well, you're gonna really like it. It's tangy from the blue cheese. I love the balsamic on it. The bacon is very good. Awesome. I should pass a point salad. Yeah. I am everyone. Sarah is so excited, and I'm so excited. Yeah, this is amazing. I'm here at the most amazing person. I'm at the most amazing restaurant. We're having the most amazing wedge salad ever made. Look at that. Maybe not ever made, but uh, all right. I'm a, yeah, I'm a, it's tasting good. I, I'm going to dig into. All right, everyone. Before I take a bite of the wedge salad, I brought this up to Sarah. Leave a comment if you remember the game that came from the desert. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, oh my bacon. I told you. Oh no. There it is. Is this the best wedge salad in the world? Look, probably not. It tastes like it tonight, it though. It tastes like it tonight, though, everyone. So let me have one more bite on camera because, listen, everyone, we're suffering for you. <laughs> no, but it's great to know that they have kind of the regular option, but also a vegan option, too. Yep. So if you're dairy free, it's one of the things we do like about this place. Extremely good. Sarah, ready to finish this? Uh huh. Let's do it. Alright, so everyone, look. Look. Allergy fries. Allergy burger for me. It, 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 incredible. Look, just look. Look. Oh, Sarah. 50th anniversary. Oh, yeah. Brand. See that? Yes. And it has all the parks. Magic Kingdom, Animal Kingdom, Epcot, and Studios. Anyway, look at this. Look, look at this. Everyone. 
so much bacon. Shall I take a bite? Yeah. It's so good. The bacon. Everyone look. That's extra crispy. Yeah, look at that. The bacon alone is delicious. The burger's great. Can you try the fries? Well, uh, this isn't like a top three burger ever. But you know what it is? At Disney property, top ten somewhere, probably higher than that, top five. Look at these. Look at these delicious fries. Oh, hot. We love their steak fries here. Sarah knows I, they're hot everywhere. <laughs> Sarah knows I like steak fries anyway, but Sci-Fi Diamond, they're, we've done, did we vlog this one? We did ones that are, we've had these as appetizers with uh, different toppings. Yeah, we didn't vlog that. You vlog it? All right. Absolutely delicious. Sarah, you ready to dig into yours? Yes, I'm starving. Let's do it. I consider this <laughs> Sarah's stealing my thing, so. Oh, you're already eating it. Okay. They are hot. They're very hot, yeah. They're very good. They're fresh. They're, yeah, oh, they are extremely they're fresh. Good. So, what mm -hmm. did you get, Sarah? I got a turkey wrap. <laughs> I got a trigger wrap. Mm -hmm. What's good, though? Yeah, it's in a gluten free wrap. They use, okay. um, I think it's Feel Good Foods brand. Um, but I've gotten this before. It's gluten free and dairy free. It comes with um, bacon, tomato, turkey lettuce and an avocado aioli which I got an extra side up because it's great for dipping in fries and also extra for your sandwich. So I'm gonna dig in. Okay. How is it Sarah? You know what? Again. Is it fancy? No. No. Does it tastes really good? Uh-huh. Yes it does. It's just nice and I'm like you really can't get like wraps and stuff anywhere if you yeah, see so. I like it again great gluten free and dairy free option so Super it's awesome. Very good. Very good. Again, nothing fancy, but yes. I like it's just fresh, it tastes good, yeah. it's reasonably priced. Yep. And these fries are amazing. Are where it's at. I'm yeah. not even a stick fry fan. There it is. I'm Sarah, it you can use it once. Say it. There it is. There it is. There it is. Oh my gosh. Oh, I so I'm o I'm over. Overflowing. Overflowing. So I got the um, gluten-free, dairy-free, and plant-based, so the vegan um, cookie shake. So it has a non-dairy whipped cream. It's got um, tofuti in it right now with the uh, chocolate syrup. Um, so the ice cream is tofuti, and then an enjoy life cookie, and that's all kind of blended in here, too. Okay. Oh. I get this every time. She does. Ooh. The whip is different than it was the last time we were here. It was more okay. the last time this is more like oh geez, I'm making a mess. Everyone, it's overflowing. Come on. It's like there'll be oil. Does everyone remember the best film There Will Be Blood? It's really good. It's super tasty. Just as good as ever. If you come here, <laughs> you need to get this. Sarah says free. that every time. Yeah, even if you're just gluten free, yeah. it's so good. So I'm very excited, and I'm going to keep digging in because I'm, I'm overloaded, but <laughs> keep going. Ready? Mm -hmm. right, so I got a hot fudge sundae. I not wait, look at it. You not get this every time. Not as messy as Sarah's. But, um, it's pretty close. I get it every time. Everyone, I apologize for taking the bite. It's probably going to be messy. I am sorry. Where I got back in. Well, we got extra napkins because we're extra messy. It, it's so good. It, if you come to Sci Fi Dining and you, you can, can have dairy, dinner, and you can have dairy, or even if you can, I want to try Sarah's one day. If you no. can't have dairy, try hers. Um, this is delicious. If you can have dairy for dietary, if you don't have any dairy dietary restrictions, you don't have dairy for whatever other reason, absolutely hot foot Sunday. Delicious. And this is a great, great way. And not just a day, but a, a dinner. So, this is amazing to be back. I'm happy to be here with Sarah, and uh, we're happy to share it with you. We are. It's so cold. We 
It's actually chilly, and we're in this little breezeway area here, so Keep it's a little chilly. Because it is so cold. Yeah, it's actually cold out right well, you now. Don't have to have and and, and we are not alone, and neither of us is from Florida. So no. we we understand. We do understand. We grew up in winter. Yeah, the, we do understand the people that make fun of Floridians, but we are now Floridians. <laughs> yeah, we both live in too long. Fifty eight degrees, feeling like fifty one, whatever. I think it's the, less than that now. Yeah, it's probably oh. less than that. And see, there's the wind. It's chilly. We are not alone. Uh, Nicole, to the bone. <laughs> I just want to cut open a tauntaun and crawl into it. Yeah. That's what I want to do. So yeah, we're uh, probably gonna make this quick yeah. <laughs> um, to get to the car. Get, 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 get that heat turned on, get those uh -huh. heated seats turned on. Uh -huh. But uh, so Sarah, Sci Fi Dine, I, listen, we said it in our video, in our, re in our actual when we sat down. It's it's one of our favorite spots on Disney property. It is. I mean, my hat's all uh -oh. crooked right now. That's okay. Um, it is one of our favorite places on property. Their prices are super affordable. We realized that today. I'm like, oh, this bill's not too terrible, which is great. Yeah. Um, and the food is delicious. And after two years, did it live to the hype, Brandon? Uh, yeah, it did. It surpassed the hype. And what helped it was beginning to end it was great. And our server, Mike, was outstanding. He actually, not uh -huh. that they ever don't, not that they ever don't, but he actually, you could tell he really cared about allergies and everything like that. So as a matter of fact, at the end, because well, I think saying, you brought it, go ahead. Yep. Yeah, so he's also vegan, so I think he understands the special diet's perspective of making sure vegans are safe for you. Um, yeah, so I think he really just understood that. And then we didn't talk to a chef a lot of times at Sci Fi. We will actually yep. speak to a chef, but the chefs there are always really great. Um, but Mike really worked through the options, yep. and I ordered the gluten free, dairy free, and vegan um, cookie shake. And I was asking him questions because the vegan whipped cream that was on it looks really different from the, what I normally get with that shake. Usually it's kind of more aerated. And he was like, it's the same whipped cream we use, we've always used. And I'm like, oh, well, it looks really different. And so he was like, no, I'm going to go investigate. And he did. And he did. And it turned out the chef over-whipped it and didn't put <laughs> it, couldn't put it in the air reader because it got too thick. Yeah. So it was just really awesome that he went above and beyond and checked above that. And beyond. Again, it was safe for me. I was like, he, he joked, he was like, yeah, it's like you got coconut yeah. milk ice cream on top of your other non-dairy ice cream, which was pretty funny. Yeah, um, so yeah, above and beyond. Above is, and beyond. And leave a comment if you remember the TV show Space, Above and Beyond. Oh yeah, that was <laughs> maybe not the best show, but I really Yeah. But yeah, it was really good. He was really helpful, talked through everything, um, and just made the meal experience really pleasant. Yeah. And overall, I want to come back again. Yeah, I, short debrief, like we said, but there's not much more to say than what we happened while we were there. Yeah. Delicious. And if you have a special diet, I really would encourage you to come here. Yeah. Because we know people who are vegan, who have other allergies, who maybe are fussy and have always had a really great time. Yeah, I was, they've always had a great time. So with that, I'm not sure there's more else to yeah, say. Yeah, there's not much more else to say. Great theme, yeah. great food, good special diets options, yeah. great servers, Outstanding. Great so yeah, go thank you, Sci-Fi Dine-In. Go eat there if you can. If you've been there, go back. If you haven't been there, please check it out. Yeah, next time I want to try the vegan burger. Yep. But anything else? No, I'm cold. All right, yeah, we're getting out of here. Um, with that, thank you to all the patrons on Patreon. Every single one of you is an amazing individual. Um, thank you to everyone that subscribes, likes, hit the thumbs up, hit the bell. I know I'm probably forgetting something, but leave a comment. Have you, you been here? Yeah. yeah. Or? We froze. <laughs> we froze up. so frozen. Or, yeah, well, yeah. if you saw what we got, what did you like? Yeah. What did you get? I can't even talk because <laughs> I am so cold. So with that, we're getting out of here. We're so keep this quick thanks video. for coming with us, though. Yeah, and so, we can't wait to come back again. Yeah, so that's it. Yeah, right. perfect. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.